What's up guys, I'm Kojak and we are spectating the brand new map containment based off of a rundown city in Mexico. And what we're going to do is we're going to go in third person right here in spectator mode and we're just going to try to see the ins and outs of this map. You have to remember that this is my first time on this map. I've never seen it just like you haven't either if you're watching this. So we're going to start in one corner we're going to try to hit as much as we can. And hopefully we don't miss too much. So this looks like the first so that's the second level. Let's uh, go out of this hole here and go down below. You can come through this door into this what looks to be a church. And were we in the... Oh, okay. We were in the first level. And you have a doorway here, a little ghost symbol. Where does this hallway take you? It takes you uh, pretty much right to where you came in, right here. It's what would be the second floor, one and a half floor, whatever you want to call it. But that's where it comes out. The walls are all broken down. So if we go the other way in the church, again, another doorway, same thing, right to the front. And then uh, we got a doorway in the back here, which will lead to some crates and another building that we'll check out in a second. Let's go up a little bit. We've got a bridge, some bells here. Cannot get to the third story. Uh, doesn't look like it. Uh, also, it doesn't look like, unless I'm wrong, you can't get up here. Well, there's a ladder here, so there must be some sort of way that's going to allow you to get up here, maybe. But I'm just not seeing it. So, let's uh, go ahead and check out over here. You have a back alleyway, which takes a sharp left and ends right... Just ends. It just ends right there. Maybe you can climb over, but either way, there's a doorway here, some bathrooms, and we are in what looks to be a little restaurant. You have a cafe... Um, so that back alley pretty much just takes you right to this hallway, right to where we came out. Kind of like a small circle here. I didn't see any way upstairs. And that really is, other than this section right here with that burning bus and this truck, that is the first half, uh, first little section of this map. We're going to move on to the middle now, where we have the dried off riverbed. Little canal here. Um, go underneath. What was that? Oh, every time we get close to this truck, it looks like it's got that uh, sound that goes off when they're doing that nuclear testing. Makes me wonder if we stay too long next to this truck, if that means we will die if we stay too long. Um, I'm pretty interested to see what that means according to the character in-game and multiplayer. So again, you can go underneath the bridge, you can run straight across, you can go up here, kind of flank this way, you can take it up the middle, try to hit them head on. They can come up this way out of here, and they can come from what looks to be right here. Okay, there we go. There's stairs right here. You come down here. There's stairs right here. So let's just go up, take a look at the middle, and remember what we just talked about. Going all the way, there's plenty of pathways to get across. You can go over, but you're very exposed. So it's more of what your preference is. Maybe you got an AR, you're running gun. You just want to go right across the middle, use the truck for a little bit of cover, and just break on into their area and uh, take them all down. There are a lot of these little red skulls laying around. Uh, we come up out of the middle here, and we've got a dead end, which leads to a ladder. Oh, it's also got an opening over here, but first the ladder comes up here. This, this is where you're going to find your snipers, I think. You're going to have your snipers sitting over here, trying to pick you off here. Maybe one right here, maybe getting underneath, across that doorway. Um, yeah, I definitely think that's going to be an area you need to watch if you are not sniping or if you are sniping, if you can get an area, a good look at that, I would uh, take advantage of that. Another red skull. The ghosts have definitely been here. Maybe they're the ones that trashed this town. We've got a bar, pretty run down, some pool tables. Uh, let's go back out the way we were and let's see. Okay, both these doorways lead to the same way. And we've got a garage over here, but that doesn't matter. It's barricaded off. We cannot access that. Um, come back through here. It's a decent size opening. And really not much other than this truck. Some garbage pails. And then some uh, pipes here that you can hide behind. What does the sign say? I, I don't speak Spanish. I don't know if that actually means anything. Uh, something $400 for gas, which that's outrageous. So let's see here. Say we're over here and we need somewhere to go. Where's the first place we look? We look either here, back into the bar, or we take the stairs right here. We'll go up the stairs into what 
was somebody's home, not anymore. Oh, we got some Porter's beer right there from uh, from Freight. Another Red Skull. I don't know if this is actually going to mean anything. But, well, there's nowhere really to go here. What's through here? All right, the stairs are through here. So we can't really go anywhere else. We're forced to go down this ladder. And if we... Okay, so there's no way to get inside. So once you're over into this area where we just were, there's not a lot of ways to go. It looks like you can probably go up, up back onto the roof, uh, then into the billiards, and then drop down to the first floor, but not a lot of area to move. Uh, come back here again. Nowhere to really hide. What looks to be a ladder that right back up into the gas station here. Uh, see here some crates, a vehicle, and this looks to be the last building that we haven't covered yet. So, well, we'll start from back here. We're going to start at the bottom. You got an entrance here. Go in. It's another uh, lot of porter beer, a little beer shop, uh, convenience store kind of thing it looks like. You've got a door towards the middle, and once you leave this door, you're going to be totally exposed. So we either need to hide behind that truck there quick, get over to here, or book it down here and across. Nope, that sound's going off. It must mean we're too close to the truck. All right, so we're going to head back up, and it looked like there was an upstairs. Let's see if we can check that out. Oh, I'm caught on the roof. All right, is there... An... Okay, so there is an upstairs, but... There is no way to get upstairs. Alright, so that's just a lower level, one floor kind of thing. We got some magazines here. So we're going to end up, we're going to go out the back door that we haven't really gone out yet to check anything out. This is going to take you back this way where you can go down again. Or you'll be heading over this way and you can take the stairs right back down into the creek bed here and up and across. So uh, not a lot with second floors. It's all really one floored area except for you can get on the roof here at the billiard place. Um, yeah, other than that, stay out of the middle. If they call in a care package, stay out of the middle. Because see that mountain? I, th I think it's from that mountain. I don't know where else it would come from. Big ass nuke is going to shoot up into the sky, come flying down, and hit right... Where'd the bridge go? Right? I think it's going to hit the bridge, and that's probably going to what's going to be explodes the truck. There's, like, nuclear stuff everywhere. That whole middle section is just going to explode. You don't want to be anywhere in there. You want to be over here or over here, but not here. Oh, excuse me. But thank you guys for watching. I'm Kojak, and uh, if you guys want to see more of this, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give it a thumbs up possibly share this video tweet it facebook however you need to do it uh, also there's a link in the description where you can click that and it'll take you to my playlist with all my dlc uh, depending on what video it is it might be an easter egg uh, but there'll be all new onslaught content right there so i will talk to you guys later and thank you for watching and i hope this was helpful to everybody that uh, got to see it